With the pandemic slowly easing, department stores are eager to welcome back tourists. A department store in Taipei has organized a French-themed summer camp on its 89th floor. The camp offers fun activities for both children and the young at heart, including storytelling in French, French movie screenings, and a drawing competition that ends on August 14th. Our very own Stephanie Yang has more. After signing up, you can come on the 89th floor and draw. Painters render the beautiful landscape of Taipei from the 89th floor. Looking out, painters can observe the northern parts of the city, Datun Mountain, Yangmingshan, Songshan, Nehu District, and more. This is a painting competition organized by a department store in Taipei. The winner gets a prize of 20,000 NT. We've all been going through this epidemic over the past two years. Without tourists, we've been reevaluating the observatory's role as a landmark. What kind of experience should we be giving to visitors? We think it's still all about the experience. Over the short period of time, we've updated the content of the observatory. We've added a new experience, a secret realm in the clouds. And we brought in the best cafe as well as special egg cakes. We're also holding our first whimsical drawing competition in the clouds. The activities on offer include movie screenings and French picture book story time sessions with staff from the Alliance Francaise. On Friday and Saturday afternoons from 5.30 to 6.30, we will hold free screenings of cartoons from Europe and France. There will also be activities based on French stories. Children can play games and a big sister will come to tell stories. Teachers from the Alliance Francaise will teach simple French. Visitors can also enjoy coffee and try out German-style sandwiches and various French cakes. We call it a French summer camp. In July, some border restrictions will be lifted and there will be celebrations such as Bastille Day. At the observatory, we've built a secret garden in the clouds. Here, you can enjoy good specialty coffee, award-winning coffee from Germany. With the world slowly opening up, this department store is eager to welcome more tourists. FTV reporter Stephanie Yang and Li Yihan in Taipei.